guys welcome back to the channel i know it's been way too long um, but we're back we've got some really really cool updates coming and i need a haircut lots of stuff on the horizon house tours new car long 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 process to finally get this new car uh, and which car am i gonna buy i would love to hear from you guys in the comments um, i've got a few special sort of cars in mind but uh, which one am i gonna pull the trigger on we will soon find out for this baby she's going car is about to be uh, sold and we're moving on to something real special all right let's go my last update um, and so I wanted to let all, all the subscribers everyone out there know kind of what I'm doing right now um, I've been working my tail off for the last sort of year um, during the COVID during the pandemic just trying to sort of get that get that money to get to the next sort of step in the my car sort of buying process um, if you have sort of subscribed to the channel if you've watched the channel you guys know that I'm that I'm very very hungry for a C63 S coupe that's always been my sort of dream car um, and I'm pleased to sort of announce that I'm getting very very close to that dream um, you know in saying that I don't know if if the C63 should necessarily be the hundred percent car I, I buy I think I think I want to sort of entertain a couple other little ideas a couple other little potential cars a um, few cars that I'm looking at right now um, one is the Audi RS5 I think is is sitting in the C63 sort of you know grouping at least um, the new M4 competitions if you can get over that sort of that mammoth grill in the front the m4 competition is something else i'm looking at um and then maybe potentially a glc 63 but i don't think that's in the running i'm more after a, a coupe i think that's kind of where my mindset is is right now um, and i tell you guys I've, I've been i've been fantasizing about a c63 amg product for the longest time um, to the point where my wife is just going bonkers with me talking about this she can't stand it she's like let's just let's just do it let's get it going so i kind of want you know a, a 2019 or newer i think that's kind of the play right now um you know obviously amg's c63 line is moving to a hybrid you know four cylinder hybrid system probably better car yes um, but without all the sound without the v8 power so my goal is to buy something and this is dependent on price point from 2019 onwards and if i can get my hands on a nice you know 2011 in the spec that i'm after i think that would be ideal um but that's kind of my mindset um again i you know i've got a few other cars in mind that i'd like to test drive potentially a, you know a, um a Macan Porsche Macan GTS I would love to sort of test drive that GLC 63s is something that I would love to test drive and then these M4s um, RS5 products as well I'd, I'd really like to get behind the wheel of, of these just just to compare and kind of see where I'm at um, but that's kind of where I'm at with uh, with regards to the car update um, the Philadelphia oh, there's a nice Supra the Philadelphia Auto Show starts in about a week here, uh, so I'm gonna try and do a live stream for you guys. See all the tasty little tidbits that are going on uh, going on down there. Uh, so I'll, I'll definitely be be down there trying to do some stuff. So you know, definitely stay tuned to that. Um, with regards to this car, this Infinity, I've actually just put it for sale. Um, you know, the the car market is really hot right now. Um, 
you know the used car market so I figured why you know why wait for the next six months to, to perfectly sync up with with me finding a new car in the spec that I want why not just try and get top dollar for this right now you know while it's in demand um, and then you know when the time is right just kind of move to uh, to a newer car so the cars you know the car has been listed um, I'll I'll put the listing actually um, or a couple of listings I've listed it a couple different places um, in the link below here you guys can take a look at it if anyone's interested if you know who's someone that's interested in a new car and I'll give you a pretty good deal I'm not really looking to like make top top dollar on it I just just want a little bit of cash to sort of turn that over to my uh, my next sort of venture my next vehicle so I'll definitely link the uh, the car in the, in the description um, but yeah she's for sale moving forward moving on to the next chapter let's go so just a couple other cool things that I got going on guys in the next little while is is I've, I've kind of teamed up with a, a couple of the real estate agents in the, the luxury sort of market um, in this area here, mainline Philadelphia. And I'm going to be trying to bring some uh, some sort of luxury, you know, mansion home tours in the next little while. Uh, I've got some good access to some nice properties. Uh, so stay tuned for that. I'm actually shooting one in the next little while. Um, should be up in the next couple of days, um, but should be pretty pretty cool. Um, in addition to that, I don't know if you guys followed Mr. JWW, uh, one of my biggest inspirations, one of my biggest you know sort of favorite YouTubers. Him and Shmi um, have been the guys that I've kind of followed since day one and have inspired me to get my own sort of YouTube channel going on. Uh, but Mr. JWW has just come out with his own sort of line of sunglasses. Um, and the, the whole premise of his glasses is super, super cool. It's all, you know, very sort of innovative, cool, sort of modern technology in terms of, you know, sunglass technology, if I take it for what it is. Um, but he's named all of his sunglasses around experiences that he's, that he's had in the automotive sort of world, um, you know, be it, a, you know, the canyons in, in, um, in California, you know, the, you know, the, the underground passage in Monaco, the F1 racetrack in Monaco, um, you know, La Lovato, I think, I believe it's called, um, but he's named all these like different sort of, you know, these, the, his sunglasses line is essentially named after these little cool experiences that he's had along his journey um, in his YouTube sort of career, which I found very, very cool. So, um, you know, this is not a plug. I don't, e I don't even know Mr. J JWW, but I went on in the first sort of, you know, first couple hours of him, you know, unveiling his, his sunglass line and bought myself a pair of Lovatos, which, which are super, super cool in my opinion. Um, so I'll link his, his stuff below here um, so you can go take a look um, at what's going on. Uh, it's pretty pretty cool stuff pretty cool sunglasses and this is coming from a guy who's got like I've got $25 pair uh, sunglasses on from Target right now but guys get a, get back at me I'm back um, you know I'm coming I'm gonna be starting producing lots of content you know look for stuff you know every every sort of I don't want to put a timeline on it but I'm but I'm back I'm, I'm excited about producing videos again you know getting to that next car sort of hurdle getting this one sold um, you know the home tours a bunch of stuff coming out some car meets and stuff like that um, really really hard you know thinking now about what the next vehicle should be so you know I'd really appreciate you guys you know the following that I have to come at me in the comments and you know let me know what's you know what's out there you know, just saw a, a Toyota Supra there and you know there's been a couple Supras in the area that have that have you know a car that I've never really thought like about potentially buying but getting next to one and hearing all the you know the cracks and bangs and you know the, the styling elements of it it's pretty pretty sweet you know and and it you know at, at the price point that it that it's coming in at i mean it, it could definitely be an option um you know again amg is sort of you know especially the c63 is like really dear to my heart it's it's been that sort of childhood dream for me something that i've always wanted but i'm definitely into sort of entertaining something something different um, if there's something out there worth sort of exploring so let me know guys what you think because um, we're in this sort of together I want to you know I want to buy a car that I can produce content on that that people want to see right that you guys want to see I want to build more of a following so let me know what you guys think um, again I'll you know I'll be up I'll be I'll be pumping things out in the next little while um, and I hope that you guys, you know, if you're not subscribed, that you will subscribe and, you know, be an avid sort of watcher of the, of the channel. Okay? Sharp moves. Tuning out. 
see you guys soon.